This is a new tutorial about. Oh, I messed up that start, but anyway, hello, welcome to a new tutorial about how to survive your first night in Minecraft Pocket Edition, and it's also a new Let's Play, which is going to be in a survival world, as you can see up here, and it has no seed to provide. Come there. But anyway, we create our world. There we go. Generating world, building terrain. I have a feeling that I'm going to spawn in a tiny potato biome. I really don't know how to spawn. Ooh, playing water. Seriously. Oh, this, this is not actually good. Right. As soon as you start Minecraft, let's go on to the tutorial. First thing you need to do is gather some wood. Wood is important as it crafts a lot of items. I don't know if although it's not really the 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 item that needs most like not it's not the item that makes most items. Iron is a iron actually makes most iron items. But People say that 11 blocks of wood should give you enough to survive a few nights. <coughs> Let's go. Try not to sprint too much. Because... Wait, I'm just going to check if... The... I'm just going to check in the options if the... Yeah, oh, difficulty's over there. That's your normal difficulty. This is like... No faulty. This is good for new players. Actually, no, I think that's easy difficulty. But this is going to be how to survive your first night. This might actually be have to be a two-part episode. Well, it's, the full night cycle is 20 minutes long. I make videos up to 15 minutes long, so I'll have 10 minute long videos. So this one will be the entire day. And how to survive. Oh, look at this. This is a fallen tree. These are quite rare. Sorry about the laggy. It's quite laggy at the moment. We've got 11. So next, what you want to do is... Oh, look at that village. Oh, let's just forget about that for now. We'll go in that in the third episode. So, first, we need to craft a crafting table. To do this, you need to press the three dots on your hotbar, and then go into this crafting table thing. You can craft some awkward plants. Then, it will show you some more crafting recipes. First, you want to... I accidentally pressed it twice. Okay, anyway, once you have a crafting table, you can craft more items. So, you'll want to craft some more liquid planks, and you see a whole lot more items come up. Once you do this, you need to get some sticks, and you can see a whole lot more items come up. These are all the items that you can craft sticks and wood, but if you want to craft some wooden tools, wooden sword. Be the, we'll do the trick. Don't need to do it twice. But anyway, once you've done this, you can dig a hole in a in a cliff. This is like Stone Age when the when people used to go in caves. And if you didn't know, Minecraft was actually gonna originally be called Cave Game. Um. Sorry about that. Um, I've got hay fever at the moment. Well, laggy. Anyway, need to check the time. This will be my longest episode. Also, now I've got, I've got stone. There's also coal here, which you do want to get a lot of because you'll need to it to fuel a furnace. 
things like iron ore. We have hay fever, I said, and might have to to wipe some snot off my nose. Anyway, four coal. It's time. You can check the time by looking at the. Uh, okay, that was a lot laggy. It's about midnight. We're halfway through the day. Or oh, just. Uh, more laggy. Anyway. It's laggy. Oh, it's quite laggy. But we're we're doing we're digging out a bit more area. And this is actually my first uh, survival with with the crosshair crosshair. I, I don't know how to pronounce it, but there's split controls which adds this little cross in the middle of the screen. And this is, is this is more like the the PC and Xbox editions, so I'm going to stick with this for now. And if there is a lot of on the floor, I would suggest getting it. Then, if you can, fill it with any any materials that you can, so you don't fall into it. Or to get more materials, you could just mine the rest of the floor, but. But that would mean that you'd have to go jump when you need. And that means that you will... So this is exactly what you need to to find the, the coal. But anyway, let's fill it up with cobblestone. And we said this is exactly what you need to find the coal with. That didn't make sense. I am quite horrible, well, not horrible, but terrible at pronouncing things, and my sister is shouting like crazy. I don't know how good her, if you had a good night's sleep, but you can see my, my wooden pickaxe is very, very low on health. My sister. We need to get more sticks. Because with these you can craft a stone pickaxe to upgrade it. You can also craft stone sword, I mean. Wooden pickaxe. And you can also craft a stone axe. These are all good items to craft. But my mum's just came back in. So. Uh, might be coming in to ruin this this video. <laughs> My sister is having a huge tantrum. She's only uh, five years old. Okay, so what's the time? Is the sun setting? Which way is the sun? I can't see the sun. This is a lucky spawn. Also, uh, anyway, we're, with the, the coal, we can craft torches. Which crafts four torches, so I think that's three, you get twelve because three times for twelve. Simple maths. You put some like this is when you get quite oh it's really laggy. I hate this lag. Really don't no. to mark out my house, I'm going to some torches. There we go. Travel will get you will be able to remove that dirt quicker. And uh, where's the sun? I guess it's probably over there. At the moment. No? Oh. 
sun starting to go down. So, what we'll need now, we'll need to craft a wooden door. Now, in easy and normal difficulty, zombies can't break down doors, but, but in hard mode difficulty, uh, they break down wooden doors, but not iron doors. So I need to craft an iron door to make sure that you're safe from zombies. Anyway. This is now. Next video will be me trying to survive the night. I will. And new video will come out maybe maybe this afternoon once I finish okay so this is the end of the video this is my house so far so I'm gonna end this video now